Hello, and thank you so very much for joining me tonight. I go by Luna Neat, and I am incredibly honored to be creating for you a super gentle, by proxy, energy work session, specifically to support you in drifting off to sleep and waking feeling incredibly refreshed, re revitalized. We want to focus on getting out of our body's way, getting out of our subconscious mind's way, and just allowing the process of healing, of, of letting our higher intelligence take care of what it needs to, release, cleansing on a physical level, on an emotional level, on a mental level, on a spiritual level, all right? So it's a bit general. But I hope you enjoy and are able to relax and just drift off to sleep, okay? Just want to drift off. I'm gonna start with a candle. Just to set a gentle intention. behalf of your and my and everyone else's highest and greatest good and perfect comfort and alignment. We're working with this session today to support deep rest, rejuvenation, healing on all the levels we just covered, mind, body, spirit, and emotions, mental, Right. If you'd like to set your own intention before you drift off, just have a look at this little candle, this flame, and choose what you'd like to intend. It might be a wish, it might be an answer to some question, whatever it is. I would include, let's allow the space for this to happen. Let's allow our subconscious mind and our higher self to facilitate this healing while we rest and receive this little gentle energy session. of herbs. Looks like maybe lavender, maybe some black sage. I want to say some roses maybe. These were handcrafted. This was a gift from uh, Mocha Action. little bundle. Just add some energy to the intention and offering to the divine for this work.
really hurts when we cleanse the outer energy field, kind of dust off from the day your head just down the center of your body first your arms shoulders dusting them off releasing any burdens we might be carrying any weight from the day This sweet little rattle from the rattle maker. And it's very nice because I don't think I need to lower the microphone uh, at all for this. Right. So I'm very focused on what you can see, you know, even if you have your eyes closed. I'm going to be focusing here on you the sweet little hummingbird rattle to cleanse and really brush off the day just before we get nice and sleepy or as we get nice and sleepy just kind of moving the energy around you through some messages or invite some messages to work with while we're healing in the dream space. If you're looking for some kind of activation, clarity, message, reminder, validation of some kind, Include in your invitation for that to come through in your dream. We'll focus on the jaw and the ear. to it, to allowing this to happen without our conscious um, awareness, if that makes sense. Like, I assign my higher self the task of doing whatever I need, even if I don't know what I need. I assign my higher self and my subconscious mind the task of releasing any thought patterns or energetic influences or this ease in my body and I don't even have to see it I don't, maybe I don't even have to and I'm okay with that too so I want to work on the conscious mind, the throat
brush off your shoulders, your back. your head. of your feet. That we've kind of rustled things up a bit got some flow going some things kind of coming to the surface working their way out of the it's almost layered like i want to use the word epidermis you know working its way out detoxifying perhaps i'm gonna use this really beautiful little amethyst druzy kind of clustered to comb through your energy field and release anything or pull away anything that's come to the surface at this point. Alright. So we're gonna comb, comb through your energy field. You can close your eyes if you like. All around your face. Really because what might have been stirred out might be held as a, an image, let's say, or might have been tied to an image, the astral senses, your inner knowing, and maybe trapped a little, anything that doesn't serve you to be released, same as the throat. your body, starting at the back of your head. I'll bring you back a little, if I can. <laughs> back of the head, just combing down like this. Like little scrubbing bubbles, carrying any, carrying it all away. Up 
tops of your shoulders. Remember to breathe comfortably. And when you feel called to exhale with some purpose, to blow it away. Coming down your back, from your shoulders, down your spine, the sides of your back as well. Under your arms, the sides of your torso. Your hip bones, pelvis, pelvic area, like lower abdomen, down your legs, past your knees, down your calf and chin, and right out the tips of your toes. Palm points. Right out the tips of your fingers. Release, clear, cleanse. Open up to receiving. I have this beautiful Douglas fur from this Jamsia, which I love for creating a nice protective square box container for us to drift so gently into this healing space of sleep. I believe, of course, you know, kind of obvious, all sleep is healing, but we really want to intentionally connect with letting go, letting it happen. And when I say letting go, it's not just like, oh, let it go, let it go. But let go as in be free, you know? Give yourself some credit. Give your higher intelligence some credit. Give your body, your mind, your emotional self that ability intentionally to do what it needs to be done to serve you best. Doing this around dream work just has a nice effect to it. I'll just put it that way. Alright, so we're going to spread to the north. Call in the guards of the north, the spirits of the north, the energies of the north, the south. Guardians of the South, the energy, the East, Guardians of the East, our guides associated with air, and the West, the water elements. Western guides. All right. Now we're going to use this peppermint essential oil. invigorating, cooling, but soothing, kind of like, um, like how Tiger Balm or Icy Hot 
it's like a bit woo but it also helps us to ease and relax. That's why I brought this one out or chose this today. Alright, so we're gonna I'll set an intention again. On behalf of everyone's highest and greatest good and perfect comfort and alignment. This intention is to work in the dream space for purposes of healing, activations, release, even not having to deal with it. Sometimes there are things that we don't need to witness. We can just let them happen behind the scenes and reap the benefits. A bit of an open invite to set an intention for whatever you're working on. Whatever you'd like to heal or channel during your personal dream work. Little waves, little energy waves, like a tide coming in, raising up. <laughs> it's such a beautiful feeling to allow the tide to kind of wash over us. Gently drifting off into the subconscious realm into just your complete limitlessness. Balancing your inner energies. little image of like a hamster on a wheel. Just a reminder to slow down. Make sure we're looking around. Make sure we're aware. We don't have tunnel vision. Open up some pathways for your manifestations to reach you. All around your feet, these little paths form, dozens of them, potential opportunities for all the experiences your heart and soul have come here for that support you, that fulfill you and behind the scenes everything is working to support that all we have to be in charge of is ourselves and the world will fold and twist and move and bring us exactly what we align with. Little bursts of insight of love for yourself for your unique journey and for these abilities that you have so innately connected with. Just 
months before you were born, these abilities to heal, to connect the dots, to read between the lines. Time to surrender of sorts to your higher self, your higher mind. Check in with you. What's real to you? What you need right now? And just allow to be supported. in this little energy field. Alright, I send you so much love on your journey tonight. Thank you so much to those of you on Patreon, to those of you supporting through Tingles or have worked with me. I just have to always acknowledge how grateful I am for that, you know, extra support and the ability to connect. From the bottom of my heart, as always, namaste.